So the product reviews continue. Uh, some gift ideas for the holidays. And today is a cleaning product. I don't normally do cleaning products, but I have these linoleum floors that bug me. They look like they're tile, but they're not. And they tend to hold dirt. Like you can mop it and clean it and it still looks kind of dirty, dingy. Do you know what I'm talking about? I feel like there's white underneath that. So I've been looking for a product and I saw this on TV and I'm going to show you right now. Um, I'm pretty excited. If it works, I'm going to be dancing a little jig for you guys. All right. So come in close and I'll show you what I got. It's called Rejuvenate and... They claim to be amazing, and I've, I've heard that it's good, but it's like to make your floors new again. So this is the cleaner, and then this restores the floor. It puts like a, I'm guessing like a wax coating or something to protect the floor. So we're going to try both of these. If it doesn't clean, I ain't using this, and I'm taking the whole thing back. And then I got this off of QVC, I believe, called Scrub Daddy. So Scrub Daddy, it kind of looks like a happy face, and it's... You can hear it. It's a rough, strong scrubber. I mean, it's it's harsh. You would think it would scratch nonstick, but it doesn't. So I'm going to show you on one of my QVC nonstick pans. I'm going to burn an egg in it or something. I don't know what, but we're gonna we're gonna scrub out, scrub the pan with it, and I'm going to show you that it doesn't scratch. So I'm going to show you this too. I'm going to use this on the floor. So we're kind of doing two product reviews: Scrub Daddy and Rejuvenate. Let me just clean the area of any crumbs or anything that fell during cooking. All right. Got my pink scrub daddy here. Uh, let's open this and spray it. Try not to get on the other areas. Let it sit there for a minute. Use my scrub daddy just to gently work it in to all the corners. All right, so I've lightly scrubbed it. And you can see some dirt's coming off. Now I'm gonna scrub hard. All right, so you can see a little bit of dirt came off. That could just be regular daily dirt. So far I'm not impressed. Okay, we're gonna wipe this off now. Okay. Well, that didn't impress me much, but let me add the other product on to it. Other side, and we're going to... More dirt even came off, but... I don't know. Doesn't look any different, guys. Nothing impressive. I thought maybe this, these dark colorizations were, were dirt that's been in here over the years, but... That seems to be the color that they picked for the house, I guess. So I'm gonna put some uh, cheese in here. Here we go. Let that burn. I also got a little bit of chocolate shavings that I'm putting in here. All right, so I got a little burnt chocolate. God, the cheese, come on, burn. I guess we're good with it. But see that down there? That's from, I didn't clean my sink last night. That's some egg yolk. See? Right? But watch Scrub Daddy. This is the blue one that I use for my dishes. Watch. Gone. Now, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and scratch this. All right? So I'm just going to get my Scrub Daddy a little wet. Got a little bit of water in it. Okay? And I'm just going to. Well, it's non-stick, so the cheese just moves right. Look at that. Come on, get out of there. Okay, here we go, ready? Got that burnt chocolate in there. Well, that just came out easy, too. What the... Okay, this is more like a commercial. <laughs> this is more like a commercial for the pan. As you can see... And I'll rinse... Let me wipe it out with a towel. As you can see, the... Uh, Pan cleans really well, but it means Scrub Daddy didn't scratch it at all. Watch. It's really a cool device. Okay, guys, so in my opinion, this Rejuvenate didn't really rejuvenate anything. It just cleaned like normal. Uh, it didn't make it any wider. Not to say that it failed, 
but it just felt like it was just a regular cleaning product. I'm not really recommending these. Uh, they're a little pricier than other cleaning products, so you might want to go with, you know, 409, Spick and Span, or Clorox, or something else. Uh, so they're not a failure, but I don't recommend them. And then the Scrub Daddies, they're pretty cool. When you get them underwater, they get a little bit softer. They're really coarse when they dry. But as you can see on the pan that I showed you, it didn't scratch. So the Scrub Daddy's inexpensive gift, great little stocking stuffer. And then how about these pans? These are the QVC Cooks Essential. I'm gonna be reviewing end of the year on the set. I've been using them all year long and you saw how easy everything just wipes right out. Pretty crazy. All right guys, that's it. More stuff on the way. Hang in there because prime rib dinner is coming. So those can burn. Oh. Well, that's the big chocolate shaving. Ew! Oh, my wife's gonna kill me. That was for, that was for her dessert. Oh my goodness, she's gonna kill me.